What's up guys, it is Chris back with another watch video and some news on the Q Timex front. A new Marmont reissue 1975. Before I get into it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon, it is super helpful for the channel and I very much appreciate it. So this is another Q Timex reissue in another new case. This one again, 1975 obviously in the name, this is the Q Timex Marmont. The Q Timex Marmont is our reissue of an icon we first launched in 1975 at a time when quartz watches were sweeping the industry and putting mechanical watches back on their heels. Inspired by the louche design language of the time with softened edges and polished surfaces, the Marmont recalls a glorious era in Los Angeles when the rich and famous would gather at the Chateau Marmont, LA's castle on the hill. So yes, a 38 millimeter gold tone watch. This is obviously a Q Timex, so it's getting a quartz movement. Domed acrylic crystal. That gold tone is polished stainless steel, so it's a gold tone color. Polished stainless steel, the entire thing is polished. Uh, you get that Q logo at the 12 o'clock quartz above the six o'clock. A beautiful champagne dial on here, so very 70s inspired. Obviously very true to that original. Applied indices, you get a day date. And of course, as you do with all of the Q Timexes, a coin slot battery hatch on the back. You get that with all of the Q Timex, uh, which is a very nice uh, way of actually changing the battery. Uh, black leather strap on this, and it has an alligator pattern. So this is not real alligator, uh, but it looks like it. Uh, and it is in a black color. Goes really nicely with that gold and champagne tone. Uh, a really faithful recreation, as I mentioned, with a lot of 70s style. A very good looking watch, in my opinion. Uh, 38 millimeters, so they keep on coming out with these new reissues, and they are very true to the original size of these watches. So this is a very true size uh, to the original, and uh, obviously the case is sort of like a tonneau barrel shaped case a little bit. Uh, so very in keeping with the original. Uh, and it looks absolutely fantastic, and I think these are going to sell pretty well. Very good looking watch. Uh, definitely something I would like to get on the channel for a hands-on review. These are coming in at $169, so actually a little bit cheaper than the Q Timex uh, sports models that they've come out with uh, over, over the recent years. Uh, you know, the ones that I'm talking about with the Pepsi dials and things like that. So they are a little bit cheaper, but not a lot cheaper. Uh, good looking watch. Anyway, tell me what you think in the comments below. I really want to hear from you guys as usual. A lot of 70s style, a lot of 70s models being re-released by Timex. They have been pumping out a lot of hits and I really like this one as well. Uh, but like I said, tell me what you think in the comments below. I want to hear from you guys. Please also don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon. Uh, it is very helpful to uh, me bringing you these videos. I really uh, like to bring you these news videos and you hitting that bell icon uh, helps you guys get these videos in front of you. Please also follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is watchchrisblog. I have some links in the description. Those links are to Amazon. I am an affiliate of Amazon. If you click those links, it helps support the channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra or interrupt your prime benefits. However, I very much appreciate it. Anyway, thank you for logging on and I'll catch you guys in the next video.